everybody and welcome to Everyday Manna. Today we are going to make some very low carb foods. We're going to do a stuffed pork tenderloin. We're going to do a green bean casserole and we're going to make some cheesy bread sticks made out of cauliflower. In here I have about two or three tablespoons of just cream cheese that I've crumbled and about a fourth of a cup of feta cheese. I've got some salt and some pepper, some thyme, sage, dried ground mustard, and some garlic powder. And I'm going to stir that together. And then over here I have about a cup of frozen chopped spinach that I have thawed and I have squeezed out the moisture. So we want to take that and just add that to our mixture. Now this is one pork tenderloin. On one side, there will be this white piece of a tendon and you've got to get that off of there. What I want you to do is lay it flat on your board and you're gonna make an incision down the middle. You are not cutting all the way through. Then take a piece of plastic wrap or parchment paper and a meat mallet, pound this a little bit. See how much bigger that is? Now, I want to take a little bit of salt, and I'm also gonna drizzle just a little bit of olive oil. Then you're gonna take some prosciutto. If you don't have this, you don't have to put it in there. It just adds another layer of flavor. Then we got some bacon. Then we're gonna take our spinach mixture and just put that on our tenderloin. And then what you wanna do is take the tenderloin and just either roll it up or just fold it over. If you have butcher's twine, you could tie this. I don't have any here, but what I do have are toothpicks. We're gonna roast this, but we're gonna brown it first. In your skillet, I'm going to add some olive oil and we're just going to brown this tenderloin. We're gonna take that Put it on a baking sheet and I'm going to drizzle it with a little more olive oil and I'm going to pop it into a 350 degree oven for about 30 minutes. This is about half a pound, three quarters of a pound of fresh green beans. In this bag, I have some just plain pork rinds and I want to smash them into fine crumbs. Now, I have in this bowl just a little bit, half a cup, three tablespoons of just shredded Parmesan cheese. I've got some salt and some pepper. I'm going to put these in that, just going to stir that around. The green beans, I'm going to coat with a little bit of olive oil. Then take your mixture and crumble it on top of your green beans. And I like to drizzle the breadcrumbs with just a little bit more oil. And then we're gonna pop this in a 425 degree oven for about 15 to 20 minutes. We're gonna make some breadsticks, if you will, but we're gonna use a little bit of different ingredients. And I have a head of cauliflower that has been broken into little flowerettes and I'm gonna just put it all in the blender. We're gonna rice this, if you will. You wanna make sure there's no big, big chunks. Then we're gonna add some salt, some pepper, a little bit of fresh garlic. Then we're gonna add one egg, some fresh basil, and some fresh flat leaf parsley, some grated parm, and some shredded mozzarella cheese. We're gonna just combine this to make our dough. I have a baking sheet that I have lined. You're gonna put it out onto that baking dish and you're gonna pat it out into a rectangle. Then we're gonna to top it with some more shredded mozzarella cheese. Put it in a 425 degree oven, about 15 or 20 minutes or until it's golden and cooked through. Quick and easy low carb breadsticks, a delicious stuffed pork tenderloin, and a wonderful green bean casserole, all low carb, all healthy, all ready for you to eat. Thank you for joining with me and I will see you next time on Everyday Mana.